Yo, what's going on, FTF fam? Thank you so much for tuning in to yet another episode of Fat to Fit. My name is Mike Austin, and today I have a lot of explaining to do about where I've been, what's been going on, and what new things are coming to this channel in the very near future. So, without further ado, let's get straight into it. Alright guys, so recently a lot has been going on, man, and it's not anything like bad, like things have actually been going pretty well for me. Uh, my business, 333 Studios, has been doing exceptionally well um, for the past two I started it uh, in 2017, so we're coming up on our three year anniversary in November and when I started this thing my number one thing was like I wanted to be lucrative I want to do it full-time finally doing it full-time uh, making a decent amount of money as well with that so that's where all of my attention and focus has been on um, as well as you know we're still you know we're still fat to fit you know what I'm saying like we're still working out consistently um, five to six days a week with both calisthenics and weight training but I also have added a new style of exercise uh, to my repertoire and that's actually where I'm going uh, to right now. I'm on my way there right now. And basically, I started doing mixed martial arts training. Um, so I've been doing MMA for about two weeks now. Totally loving it. Um, and I've never actually been like so physically challenged in any other style of workout before like of course calisthenics is challenging weightlifting is challenging but this mma stuff is on a completely different level and i just want to share that with you guys as well as talk about things that you know are going to be coming to the channel soon i know it's been a while and i i'm always that guy to say like i'm not going to ghost you i'm not going to leave i'm going to stay consistent and then i end up doing the exact opposite so i want to talk about that later on in the video but right now let's go over to my mixed martial arts gym Yo, so we're here at the gym and one of my favorite things about my gym is that you would never know that there is a world-class martial arts academy. That there's a, that there's a world-class martial arts academy in this building. But one of the things I got going on right now is I got to throw on uh, my uniform shirt because you actually can't walk in the gym with just regular clothes on. Or hat so I got to take all this stuff off and then we're gonna walk inside and get started with my training for the day um, usually I do classes I'm actually gonna do class later on tonight at 7 but I had some free time this early afternoon so I'm just gonna train on my own um, and I'm not sure if I can record while I'm walking into the gym so I'm gonna go in I'm gonna talk to uh, my master and my coach to make sure that it's good for me to like do everything I want to do today and then we'll be good to go all right guys so we're inside of my gym right now well a, p a part of my gym this is actually the strike area since you can see like i'm surrounded by punching bags and sandbags and everything like that so today i'm actually going to run myself through a couple of striking drills i actually haven't trained mma in about three to four days i ended up jamming uh, my middle finger today it's feeling a little better um i couldn't like make a full fist when it first happened but now I can kind of take it a little easy on myself. So I'm gonna be very careful with my jab because I have to make a fist and make impact and that's really gonna hurt. But my right hand is still good to go. So I'm gonna practice a little bit of striking and then we're gonna move on to the rest of the vlog. So let's do it. So, 
all you're doing is turning and driving the shin into the back. See where you're taking, I'm not stressed out right now, so right. I can't, I can only, I'm only go by yeah, the yeah. <laughs> Watch, one, you see that? Uh -huh. Two, see how my leg goes out? Three. Three. So if we hear it, I'm like this, uh -huh. about look. Boom, Ooh. and it comes back. Got it, okay. Keep to me. Uh-huh, to me, yeah, keep to me, keep me. Rotate. Yeah, the more you rotate, I don't care if it's low, but yeah. the lower it is, the harder, the harder it is. But or with medium, but you gotta kick me, not the bad. Hit me, I don't kill you. All right, guys, I'm exhausted, tired, done in. Um, and I still have to come to class tonight in about five hours. I'm um, probably not gonna record that. It's probably just gonna be something for me. But big shout out to my coach Jamal, uh, who like came in and started helping me and instructing me with my kicks and helping me get better at my kicks. Also with my jab. Um, like I said, I haven't trained in about three to four days, so I'm a little rusty. But I'm definitely gonna get back to it. And there's gonna be a lot of good things coming from my mixed martial arts training in the near future. Uh, about a year from now, I plan on competing. So all of my training is going toward that aspect. So that's gonna be really cool. Um, but right now I'm gonna, you know, uh, cut the vlog section of the workout and move on to all the other updates, grab some food, and tell you guys about what happened, where I've been, and what's coming in the near future. All right guys, so it's the next day and right now it is 2.45 in the afternoon, which means that obviously um, I've already done like my morning routine with setting up my protein, my BCAAs, taking my creatine, my multivitamin for the day. Um, but I wanted to, you know, finish out the vlog and tell you guys, uh, you know, what's been going on and where have I been and like, you know, everything that's happening in my life and everything. Um, and recently, you know, everything's been going really, really good um, as far as like my personal life, my business. Um, and I'm still keeping up with like, you know, everything of uh, my fitness journey as well. Um, and the reason why I haven't been recording simply is just because like, I've been swamped with um, work for 333 Studios, my business, and you know I've been working, I've been blessed enough to uh, have been working with um, uh, social influencers from all over the United States and uh, multi-million dollar brands uh, that represent all kinds of like different like athletic aspects in the fitness industry as well as starting my own private modeling um agency so it's like you know i've been trying to keep up with all these things uh for 333 studios and when it came down to fact and fit of course i was still working out um six days a week and still like paying attention to my macros and my diet and doing everything i needed to do in the gym um but i just never had the time to pull out you know my camera my microphone my whole setup and you know sit like and like you know record a video um and at the gym that I'm working out at um, currently, you know, it's a great spot, great gym. The owner, Leo, is an amazing guy. Uh, but, you know, he has a rule that you can't um, bring in, like, cameras. Like, so I can record on my phone, which is fine. But, you know, I, I can't, like, come in and, like, uh, bring in my camera and record, like, a whole entire uh, YouTube video before the hours of 10 p.m. Um, it's a 24-hour gym uh, just for members. And, you know, there have been times I've been there like 2 o'clock in the morning and stuff like that in the past. But now, because of everything that's going on uh, in, 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 in my business and my personal life, I honestly just don't have the time to go and, and record 10 p.m. at night. You know, even if I do go, you know, by myself, you know, it's the, it's the matter of like the getting like the whole setup and doing all this extracurricular stuff, you know, when I'm just trying to get a good workout in. And, you know, it's throwing me off and my mind muscle connection just isn't there. Um, and then also, you know, it, it's a little bit of a pain to ask like one of my friends, like, hey, I know it's late um, and I know you got work tomorrow because unlike, unlike myself, you know, I constantly forget that all of my friends have normal jobs and I don't, you know, I'm self-employed, I work for myself. So, you know, my friend has to go to work at 9 a.m. in the morning but you know, I'm, I'm trying to record a video at, at midnight or one or two or three or three o'clock in the morning. You know, it's kind of an inconvenience for them. And I don't want to have to do that, especially since, you know, the gym's kind of far. And like, you know, it, it's a lot going on. And, you know, I just haven't had like um, the, the time nor the, like, for 
for the lack of a better word, um, equipment to actually like record a full length YouTube video these past couple of months just because of all the rules and regulations of my gym and how hectic my life has been. But you know, just because I haven't been recording doesn't mean that I haven't been working out. You know, like you guys can follow me on Instagram. I literally post on Instagram uh, every single day. If it's not like a regular post, I'm always on my story. I'm always engaging. I'm always liking and commenting on everybody's pictures and everything. So I'm always on Instagram. So definitely follow me there. Um, so that way, like, you know, you guys really don't miss out on like fat to fit in general, rather than like fat to fit on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Because fat to fit on YouTube, you know, as, as we all know, like there are, there are waves where it's very consistent and then there are ways where it's like ah oh, shit like i might just dropped off the face of the earth but that's just youtube i'm still on instagram i'm still on snapchat i'm still on facebook and stuff like that so be sure to follow me on all those all those other platforms as well um so you can always stay in the loop and stay in touch man i'm always posting like my before and after photographs and everything currently i'm working on a secret project for this youtube channel um in ways that you know uh i'm thinking of like staying more consistent and coming back is really just I have to sit down and, and organize my schedule you know like I really have to like uh, create a content calendar create times and days where I'm able to do certain things and you know like I said with the time restriction at my gym with you know only being able to record very late at night you know it, it's hard to get collaborations um, with other influencers and other uh, people in the fact to fit realm or the fitness realm or you know like it's, it's really hard to do that because everybody's like yo man like around like two o'clock in the afternoon you know let's go and, and do this let's record this video and put it on your channel i'm like oh well we gotta wait like eight more hours <laughs> to do that and then they're like well damn bro like you know i gotta i gotta work in the morning or i have some other kind of obligation i just don't have the time um and plus you know i'm training uh two to three times a day now so uh i'm, I'm doing my mixed martial arts training i'm doing weightlifting, I'm doing calisthenics, I'm doing cardio, like there's so many different factors that I want to report. There's so many different factors that, you know, I wish that I could just like show you guys everything and document every everything, but I just don't have the resources. That was the word I was looking for earlier, resources. I just don't have the resources um, to, you know, record all the time, 24 seven, you know, and I, I definitely don't have the financial resources to like branch out and have a, uh, you know, full time, videographer by my side and just record everything you know i always have to ask a friend like hey like are you busy today um i'm about to go grocery shopping would you mind recording this video and that's no problem but you know uh in in, in that in that way i'm on other people's time when i want to be on my time but i'm so used to being on my time you know when i'm ready to go i'm ready to go i don't want to have to be like all right i'm about to head to the gym right now oh wait damn let me call john Make sure John's good to, you know, record this video real quick. And I'm already dressed up and ready to go, but then I have to, you know, make sure that someone else is always ready to go too. So, you know, it gets a little discouraging not being able to record uh, YouTube videos um, all the time. Like I really, really enjoy creating YouTube videos. I really enjoy creating content. Um, but you know, uh, things are a little difficult right now to record them. Like life is good, life is great. I have no complaints about anything that's going on in my life right now. It's just that that small time constraint to record um, like workout videos. Like yeah, I can show you guys vlogs all day. I can show you what I'm eating. I could show you, you know, my daily routine. But I mean, let's face it, everybody here is subscribed to this channel uh, either for me as a person or to see some really cool workouts, beginner workouts, intermediate workouts, and to see a guy go from 235 pounds to his goal weight of 175 or 180, you know, and I'm still on that route. Um, currently, I just weighed myself this morning. Um, currently, I'm 203.5. So uh, throughout these months, you know, my weight has definitely fluctuated back and forth. There was a point that I was 198 and I was like, yes, oh my God, like just, just 12 more pounds and I'm good, 12 more pounds and I've got it. Um, but then recently I, I lost my aunt and, um, you know, it was, it was natural causes, but you know, I lost my aunt and you know, that really took me back four weeks and that weight came back currently right now, you know, I'm back on six days a week, two to three times a day working out. So 
that weight is gonna it's, it's just gonna fall off you know uh, the muscles are gonna be gained and everything like that but you know things take time and things take patience so uh, I'm, I'm, I'm saying this to say that you know I will be back in YouTube full-time it's just I have to organize my personal schedule I have to set aside time for my business 333 studios because that's how I make money that is the only way that I make money and thank God that this business is finally lucrative like I'm finally in a place um, like kind of like in the in the beginning stages of where you know I'm finally cr like creating financial freedom or like some kind of financial gain from this business rather than just oh that guy takes pictures that's cool you know so I'm finally uh, in a point where it's lucrative so I have to be on it all the time you know because if I'm not you know uh, creating videos or taking pictures for other people I'm not getting paid and unfortunately that means that I have to put my own needs on the back burner so that I can you know make some income you know um, but I definitely I'm gonna get down uh, to the point of like creating a content schedule um, reaching out to a lot of my friends who are in the fitness realm see who wants to collab when they can when they can collab um hopefully probably talk to uh the owner of my gym uh leo and see if there's some kind of way that we can figure out this schedule of like not being able to record so late at night like even if it's just like an hour or or two hours you know what i'm saying like it's just like yo like can i just like can i just like get the gym at like eight o'clock is that cool like not completely by myself you know because i can't control whether or not people come in but you know like yo like rather than 10 o'clock man can you let me come in like a couple hours early or something like that i'll be quick i'll be in and out i won't get in anybody's way things like that um but yeah so that's i mean that's really what's been going on you guys like it's not like it's not that i haven't been working out it's not that i haven't been consistent with my own personal fitness journey. It's just the fact that I've been so busy with 333 Studios that there has literally been no time uh, to do my own thing. You know, I'm so busy doing everybody else's thing. I'm so busy, you know, working with social influencers and, you know, all these brands uh, who represent, you know, all these big, like, household name athletes. And, and, like, as great as it is, like, it's really, really cool to be a part of all this stuff and be a part of, like, the beginning stages of all these like social campaigns and everything like that but then it's also just like damn man like i really want to get back to you know recording my own content rather than recording everybody else's content you know um but yeah i just wanted to close off the video with you know well the whole title of the video was like yo what happened like where, where'd you go you know um but you know i just wanted to you know sit down with you guys for a couple of minutes and just talk to you all about what happened, what's been going on, and what's going to happen in the future. Trust and believe me, I, I know, I know I say this a lot, um, Fat to Fit will be back and better than ever. Uh, things are actually being set in motion right now. Act, like As a matter of fact, like probably by the time that this video comes out, shit is probably already like, you know, like, been like, oh damn, like he's really back and he's killing it, you know? Because uh, I have so many things planned as far as like, graphic design and logos and you know i, I don't i don't want to i don't want to give everything but there's a lot you know that you know i've written down and i've drawn out and i've talked to multiple people about um so things are definitely being set in motion but yeah man so um yeah <laughs> uh so basically man uh, i just want to say thank you to all the like all the subscribers and followers on all social platforms and network all the people who you know like and comment be like yo this is amazing this is inspirational bro i love this i love this you know uh so really i appreciate you guys man because there are days when i'm discouraged and there are days where i'm just like fuck man i don't really want to do this shit you know but you guys keep me going so shout out to you all and yeah man fat to fit is coming back very very soon the train is going to keep pushing bro so yo my bad guys uh my camera battery died Thank God that it saved all the footage because I would have had to record that all over again. But if you like this video, be sure to subscribe, turn on my post notifications so that you never miss another episode of Fat to Fit. And be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat. Everything is right here or link down below in the description. Um, I post content every single day on Instagram specifically. So that's my story. That's like my post. You name it. Like um, I'm posting everything bro it don't matter everything so be sure to subscribe 
Thank you guys so much for tuning in. And I will see you next week with a brand new video. Fat to fit.